Hello everyone, uh, welcome to the Banga Flash Mob organized by the World Kizama Project. My name is Nemo Yasunero and uh, I'll show you now the first part out of the four uh, for the choreography you're gonna do, uh, we're gonna do together. And I just wanted to say uh, this is the first one, the first Banga we ever did and I'm very honored and very happy that you're all here. So yeah, let's just, let's just do it. We're gonna start with a side basic going to the left and one, two, three, we're gonna do shuffle, four and, okay? So we also want to move the butt a bit more. So for example, when I go to the side, boom, boom, boom. So try to just move your hips whenever you transfer the weight. Normally this kind of shuffle originally was just a tap, but now we really want to step and, and we're gonna move the hips a bit more than normally. So we're gonna go again and one, two, three, four and five. On five I'm gonna aim my left foot like uh, into a diagonal, so 45 degrees because I'm gonna move that way and from here we're gonna go balancer. One more time and then I'm gonna focus on balancer. We go one, two, three, shuffle, five, diagonal and I'm gonna go six, seven and eight. Now this diagonal and the feet, the idea is to sit. When we sit we have so much more options to move the hips. What I do, what I prefer is to go into eights. So the hip, for example, if I go to my left leg, the left hip goes to the side, or rotates and then to the right. And the more we can sit in our legs, it's much easier than to move. If we're up, it's very, becomes a bit stiff. Okay, so from the beginning. We go one, two, three, four, and five, six, seven, and eight. Okay, the hands, just to show, you can put them uh, facing upwards in a closed fist but relaxed, or you can go down, so, or frame. So whatever suits you, organize with your team and just, just go for it, yeah? One more time, and one, two, three, four, and five, six, seven, and eight. Good. From here I go back the same way I came from. We go one, two, now I rotate to my right. Uh, on three I'm gonna do a like a small Corrigine step towards down. So similar to Corrigine, so I want to slide down and then I move forward. So I was balancer, 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 boom, boom, and down. Okay, what I do in this position, it's like a small bend in the right knee and the right left leg uh, can be fully straight or a little bit bent. And you want to slide forward, you don't want to drop or anything, you want to slide in, yeah? So from, from the balance side, let's go. So we're going here and we go one, two, three and four. On four we go back to a normal level of the body and we go Pa, boom, seven and eight, okay? Now this is Zha Zhao, we want to go forward and back. Now what I do, I don't step, it's only like a mark. So you put 40, 50, 60% maximum and you want to mark, okay? You want to still move your body just a little bit forward so the leg moves and then there, pa, 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 and boom. Okay, also from the side, if you want to do it, you can go with the leg fully straight or a little bit bent. And you play with this, yes? From the top, side, one, two, three, four, and five, six, seven, and eight. Go one, two, three, four, and five, six, seven, and eight. So we step on the left leg on eight and we go open one and drop two, okay? So when I finish here eight, we go boom and za. The idea is sa, 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 boom, param. So now we're gonna move into a position where the hands are low. So when I open a pop, here we're gonna put, in this case, left hand forward, right, uh, right hand on the side. We drop a little bit down into a small plie and we circulate, move the hips around. So it's like round. So what I do, what, what I prefer is moving the hips to the left side, okay? So when I did 
pa pa ra pa pam pam there we go one and two and three and four five and six seven and eight so the same move is repeating once we go step in here za so here you it's not straight here no you go drop and you can also play with the shoulders okay so za so circuit to the left pam pa ra pam pa ra pa pam step and step again and again okay so the last part was five and six seven and eight one and two okay and down so down hands yeah no, wait i don't see anything ah, now you see me <laughs> round and round and zap and zap so when we're here it's not just step step we want to go za. so when the leg goes my right leg to the side shoulder go up okay so here sa sa and za so shoulder up and leg to the side so za and so as we switch original left hand forward we go pam and we switch to the right hand forward okay from the last part so we go pa 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 ra pa pa step and boom circle circle pam pa ra pam circle circle good now from here we're going to do sub simple corrigenio corrigenio is like the same step we did before it's like a slide forward so instead of just walking around we want to make it a bit more whew, deeper to emphasize it yeah so i go down boom so the left leg is a bit longer deeper step than the right so boom boom and za pam za za para za and boom we finish in this spot now we take a deep breath <sighs> and we continue by going from the top side basic going one two three shuffle five six seven eight and one two three four and five six seven and eight and one two and three and four shoulder don't forget and five and six seven and eight. beside the shoulder there's a smile so it's not being serious you can but it's nice to smile and look at the camera yeah especially later when you record and five and six seven and eight last part continue one two three four and five six and seven and you should be already in this position on eight after this shamanlo has his part a um, few notes before we wrap this up when we are going to the side from the beginning here shuffle allow yourself like i said to when you switch the feet to really emphasize the hips because this is for the video okay if you're dancing in the clubs of course you don't have to do it so much but now for the video we want to make things a bit bigger than normally and then i would move pa -pa -pa. here also relax just like your shoulders allow everything to move knees everything is down move your butt exiting here this part we know already boom and boom here also hips 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 relax the shoulders straight forward so when we film my advice for everyone who records look straight forward okay same here and then we walk around so don't look down always look forward and the idea with this banga flash mob is to show also the 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 yeah just the posture the masculine the power the focus and everything this is what we want to show through this uh, choreography also yeah i said meant it also but yeah also do that thank you again and the uh, next part is shamalo hi guys my name is shamalo and we're gonna go together on the flash mob but we're gonna start from the ending part of nemania so i'm gonna just turn myself for you to be able to follow me in a good way and the last position that you got was this one. You are on the ball of the feet with the left feet and on the right we are flat. Right now we're going to make sure that our weight is going to stay on the right side and we're going to rub the floor with the ball of the feet and make a reverse 180 degrees. If you can make more uh, emphasis and make it more beautiful, you curve. So, up. And from here, we're going to use a shuffle. So one and two. 
over here with the count is going to go this way one two and three from here we're going to restart again our weight is still on the right side and we're going to use our feet the left one i shuffle again one and two i'm going to restart slowly with you guys so we go slide shuffle on place again shuffle forward using all the time the syncopation one more time one two and three over here four and five basically what we use is the basic step of somewhere just going sideways somewhere means shadow you can also get this basic step as rule of three let's go one more time until five slowly five six seven eight one two and three four and five now our weight is still on the right side what i'm gonna do i'm just gonna shift my weight and reverse again myself 180 degrees to go to this direction but i'm gonna act like i'm going into the man side that so i'm gonna move forward in a diagonal way one more time from the top slowly we go one two and three four and five we reuse this one six seven and now we're going to use jajal it's going to be shifting the weight to the left shifting the le uh, the weight to the right and going back to the left so it's going to go in a contra tempo one more time five from the top five six and seven eight one two and three four and five six seven eight and one over here we are pretty low and we're going to start to move and the pivot the access point is going to be this one and you're just going to rotate on place okay but we're going to use this until uh, the count uh, six so basically we are in this position make sure now that your weight we are after Jean Jao, that your weight is on the left side and from here we're already at one so we go two three four five six and from six you're going to use two count to slide seven eight you close one more time from this part weight on the left we are on the first count together so i'm going to say five six seven eight one you don't move and two you go with me five six seven eight one two three four five six seven eight to make the pivot beautiful make a rotation with your chest if you know how to isolate with your chest or just with your shoulder and make the difference of the height by going up down up down up down let's try now from the top until here in a slow way let's go you can do this position are you ready now we go one two and three four and five six seven eight and one up down up down slide mark so let's go again from this part our weight is over here and we go our into our circular uh pivot so it goes two three four five and from the five we shake the shoulder forward backward five six seven eight and from this we're going to use the side step basico together so you open you close you open and on the closing way you're going to go down and use a syncopation cha cha up you open one more time and you close let's do this until here so i'm going to do it with a count for you 
our weight is on the left we are at one and i'm going to say five six seven eight one you don't move and we start to get at two five six seven eight one two three four five six seven eight one two three four and five six from here seven with the elbow so you you make sure that your elbow is touching the upper leg seven with the elbow and now you use the feet uh, the fist sorry and you eat twice so and eight one one more time from the pivot five six seven eight one two three four five six seven eight one two three four and five six seven eight and one so from this we're going to be good let's try this from the beginning until the end we go again from the last position of nemania and we're going to go for the shamado part one two and three four and five six seven eight and one two three four five six seven eight one two three four and five six seven eight and one eight and one from this we're going to use casament so it's a mix of the men's side and the lady side try to use an egg shape on the floor you imagine this so i'm going to use my first step again my weight is still on the right so i'm going to go first step with the left going making the dissociation from the point that i start from and i'm coming back to the line of the first point that i start my casament make sure to make the dissociation of the right feet not being on the same line as the left feet a little bit away from this I keep the line with my left one I'm coming back my right is joining the line of the left as you can see they're almost on the same line and from here I'm gonna use an elegant position to show the banga so from here make sure that the toes are pointing the direction of the middle of the feet above your knee use the plié and if you want to make more elegant, all the egg and you open. So from the top until here in a slow way. And after we're going to go in a regular tempo. Five, six, seven, eight. One, two, and three, four, and five, six, seven, eight, and one, two, three, four, five six seven eight one two three four and five six seven eight and one two three four five six seven eight try to make it soft because uh, on the music is not going to be a boom it's going to be really a smooth kick of the drum so open Let's try together now, real tempo. Five, six, and seven, eight. One, two, and three, four, and five, six, seven, eight, and one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, and five, six, seven, eight, and one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Hello guys, so for my part, we'll start face to the wall. Imagine the wall is the audience, okay? So we then face the people. We'll start with two side steps. I will start with my left foot from the final position of Shamalo. Like this. Then, just with the steps, side, collect side. And then right foot, side, collect side. Then these steps will just change the rhythm. Instead of doing regular steps, we'll do tam, tam, 
seven, and one, three, pump, pump. okay? One, pump, two, three, pump, four, seven, and one, ta ta, ta ta ta. And the same on the side step of the normal rhythm, the first one on each side, I will go down and one, ta ta, three, ta ta. And each time I go down, I will try to move my shoulders, okay? For the shoulders, I will show you this way. When I step with my left foot and I go down, I will move my left shoulder forward, rolling. One, ta, three, ta, okay? So face to you, left foot, left shoulder forward, going, uh, rolling down. One, two, three, four, yes? So this way, five, six, seven, and one. Ta, three, ta, ta. Here, we finish on the right foot. With the left, we'll just connect like a marker. It will be a touch step on side, and then touch on the left, okay? So, from top, and one, two, three, four, and five. And then here, I will put my weight on the left foot and lean a little bit, almost like a lunge, okay? Like this, okay? This way, here, I'm a little bit diagonal with my knee, my left knee. So here, my left knee is this way. My weight is forward on my toes. And then I will move my shoulder. And the goal is to do just pa, pa, okay? The same rhythm, boom, ta-ta, boom, ta-ta, Boom, ta ta, okay, with the shoulder. So, first, I will need, I will have to do left shoulder forward and right shoulder forward. Left, right. Papa, yeah. So, one more time from the top. Slowly, super slow. Seven and one, two, three, four and five. And then here, you do the shoulder. Boom, boom. Yes, and you finish this way. Even if you move a little bit the shoulder before the final move, it's okay. Just do pam, left shoulder first, pam pam. Okay? Then here, I will just come back on my left foot, kick, touch, rotate. Yeah? This way, I'm here, I just did pam, uh, pam pam. Then left foot. Kick right, touch, rotate. Now my weight will be on my right foot, okay? Ready to move on the left. Yeah. So, from top, seven and one, two, three, four and five, six, then seven, eight and one. It will be syncopation rhythm, okay? Faster. So. Pretty easy, practice the slow first and then speed up. It will be on the music, you feel the, the rhythm, boom, boom. Like it's super, super clear in the music. Then, boom, ta, ta, here. Then, step, turn, 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 turn. Yes, it will slow. So, one, two, three, four, five. Easy? Yeah, perfect. So, now we are back to the audience. The audience is still forward I have the, in, the, in the wall, okay? So, we are back to the audience. We just hear step, knee inside, out, in, out. All my weight will be on my left foot, okay? On my toes, like this, uh, heel up. Here, on the final, pam, 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 I will open all my body sideways. Yeah, so if I show you, face you, we are here. Pam, pam, one, two, three, four, and five. Here, sideways. Then six. I'm on left foot, about the steps, about the feet. I will just push here. Yeah, so I push with my right, on my right foot, with my left. And then while I'm pushing with my foot, I will also push with my hand. I'm not pushing like this, I'm like changing something, okay? Just throw something. So, 
One more time. We are here. Bam. Ta, ta, ta. Six, seven. Collect. Touch. Rotate. Okay? About the rhythm. Six, seven, eight, and, and then woman side up. One, two, three, four. Okay? So the step, rotate, walk will be on the eight and one. If we start this part, it will be tan tan tan. I come back here and two, three, four, and five, six, seven, eight, and one, two, three. Okay, for the woman's side up, we'll do the woman's side up, but we'll not do it straight like this. One, two, three, four, it's too flat. We'll try to curve a little bit the woman's side up, turning on the right and going on the left. Yes? So I turn on my right side, but I go on my left, like this. Boom! Ta, ta, ta. To be a little bit sideways, okay? One more time, we are face to the audience, but not strictly face, almost diagonal, okay? You will see with the rotation here, boom! It will be natural to do the woman's side out turning on the right. If the same rotation, then boom, ta, ta, okay? But it's pretty like friends. So one, two, three, step back, collect, step forward. The three first steps of the woman's side out are basic. And then I will change a little bit. Step, 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 left foot. Then step back, collect, step forward. Okay? And I will do these steps in a syncopation rhythm. Pam pam pam. One more time. One, two, three, four, and five. While I will do the four and five, once you catch the rhythm, you will change also the body move and it will do a wave forward. Okay? I will show you first, like this, for example. It's one, two, three, four, and five, six. Okay? Five forward, six backward, seven forward, and we just walk on seven. Okay? So one side down, one, two, three, four, and five. Six, seven, easy. For the weight, we're here. It would be chest forward. We just push the chest forward, then stomach, and then we come back. Yes, boom, ta. Like if you want to, if you want to roll on something, on the wall, on woman, I don't know what. To, oh man, do what you want. Just try to roll forward and come back. Okay, while you do the steps. In the one more time in the same same the same direction. One, two, three, four, and five, six, and then walk normally seven. We'll add the wave. Uh, add the wave. We'll add uh, arm smooth. One, two, three, four, and five. Okay, so I will help try to start my wave with my arms. Five. Six, seven, yes, this way, one, two, three, four, and five, six, seven, easy. Now, we're on seven, seven, eight, and, okay, I will just prepare my next step. One, two, three, four, and five, six, seven, eight, and one. So here, wave and step, collect side, bigger side step. Okay? I will collect first, boom, seven, collect side, bigger side step. And on the bigger side step, I will do a wave, like a bounce. And I will transform it in a side wave. So I'm here, walk, collect, side, then boom, we go on the toes. We go up and we land and we try to draw with the hips a circle, okay? Like boom, ta, yeah? So boom, down, come back. And one time, pretty easy. Slowly first, you're here, up, down, bend the knees, rotate, and walk. 
okay? And then we'll do the same and we'll add the arms. And boom! Okay, first without the bounce, without the flow you'll have when, once you will have a more practice. It's just boom, collect, okay? Like spread the arms, come back. Boom, tap, boom, tap, yeah? And now with more bounce, boom, tap, okay? Like, oof, and pretty easy. So, one, two, three, four, and five, six, seven, eight, and one, two, three. And then cross backward, four, my right foot. Touch, seven, five, six, seven. Okay, it's just cross and uncross steps. Right, pretty easy, one more time this way. Boom, tap, left foot. Cross the right backward, touch left. Cross the left forward, touch right. Yeah, the same. Cross, touch, cross, touch. This way, cross. Oh, sorry. <laughs> I'm here, boom. Tap, cross, touch, cross, touch. My left foot will still, will stay forward all the time. My right backward, okay? Just once each time. So, boom. Tap, bam, touch, bam, touch, cross, turn back, and walk. Okay? Like side steps. Touch, cross, bam, collect, side. And then we modify. Of course, we will not stay like this. So, we did touch step, cross backward, side, collect, side. We will try to speed up all these steps. But before, we change the, the shape. Touch, bam, bam. Okay? Touch, go down, go up. Right, right foot, touch step. Touch, go down, go up. This is my left leg. I'm going on the left. My left leg will decide the height. Okay? Like up, down, up, down, up. The same. Touch, down, up. And try to give some bounce, okay, some flow, like a wave one more time. Not too robotic, like boom, ta, 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 ta. Make, make sense? Yeah. So we are here, touch, bounce, come back. Good. Almost done. Then this is the last step, we just have to modify two details and that's it. On the last left side step, touch, pam, pam, turn, turn on the left, okay? And then once I will be here, I will add a chest bump. I know you will love it. Touch and down and boom, okay? Face to you, so sideways. Touch and down and boom. Boom. Yes? So you're here, it's boom. Like if you want to bump, uh, uh, you meet a bar, you didn't see him since uh, three months, the length of the lockdown, and then like, oh, I'm so happy to see you. Boom. The same. Okay? Just try to not push your arms and your shoulders too, too much backward. Like, uh, it's not, uh, uh, the chest is not moving. It's Boom! Like if we pull a wire from your sternum forward. Boom! 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 If you want to practice and you're not used to, just take a big breath. Like... Yes? Okay, so we have to do that. And then, the touch. From the touch till the chest bump, Faster. Pam, 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 boom. Five steps in syncopation rhythm. So if I restart this part uh, here, two, three, pam, 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 six, seven, eight, and one, two, three, four, and five, six, seven, eight, 
and one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and one. And we're done. Okay? Perfect. From the top, one more time, and then good luck. Face this way, then final pose. He does that better than me. And then one, two, three, four, and five, six, seven, eight, and one, two, three, four, and five, six, seven, eight, and one, two, three, four, and five, six, seven, eight, and one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and one. Yes? Pretty easy. The only thing we miss it's on the boom, tap, cross, touch. When we do the touch, boom. And then cross, touch. Okay? It's time the same. Cross, touch. You bump your chest with your, your wrist, close wrist, close hand like this, and look in the floor diagonal way. Yeah? And cross. Boom, ta, 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 boom. Pretty easy. Good luck. Hello, my dear friends. Welcome. My name is Ricardo Souza, and I'm here in Portugal from ALC Dance Studios for the fourth part of this beautiful project of Man Flash Mob, Kizomba Man Flash Mob, Banga. So let's bring a lot of style to what we are doing. So first, I'm going to do the combination of my part uh, without music, with the counting, facing you and back to you. Then we go through the explanation and then I will do it with music. Okay? So we finish Felician part with the weight on the left with a pop on our chest. And this was the one of the music. Boom! One. After this, we're going to do two, three, and four, and five, six, seven, and eight, and one, two, and three, and four, five, six, seven, eight. One and two and three and four. Five, six, seven, eight and one and two, three and four. Five, six, seven, eight and one. And we finish with the back to you. Five, six, seven, eight and one, two, three and four and five, six, seven and eight and one, two and three and four, five and six and seven and eight, one, two, three, four and five, six, seven, eight and one, two, three and four, five, six, seven, eight and one. Explanation. So, as you finish with the pop of Felicien, you have your right shoulder to the audience. So we walk backwards with the right leg on two, and we do a contratempo, three and four, and immediately we're gonna use N5. Bring the weight to your toes, use the strength of your hip to turn the position of your feet. So your shoulders facing the front position, and we use heel, and toes. So it's important to bring the weight either to the toes, either to the heels. Boom, bam. And as you do that, by the bending of the knees, you are not going up and down. So you arrive here, boom, bam. Here, the weight is on the left. We are on five. Start with the right leg doing two small circles on the front of your right side. And six, and seven, immediately as you are finishing the second circle, we do a contratempo and one. And from here we do the heels to the side. Boom, pa. So we have the weight on the left. Two, three, and four, and five, and six, seven, and eight. And on the, the voice of the singer, and one. Here you walk back with your left. Two, twist your heel out, and keep it low and keep the heel on the floor. We don't want to do belly dance here. So make sure that the heel is on the floor. Walking back, the same movement with the left. As you step forward with your left, prepare your arms crossed. So you walk back, touch, back, touch, walk. 
with the arms crossed in order that we can open after to do a circle. So we finish here the pumpa, left touch, right touch, prepare the weight on the left with the arms crossed and we go forward with the right leg and we prepare our bunda to the left side in order that we do turn, turn, turn and stop. Okay? So with the counting we finish here and one, going back with the left, two and three and four, five, six, seven, on eight, we're going to bring the weight to the right leg, eight, and we bring the left arm sideways as we stretch the left leg and take it off from the floor, eight, and now let's go gradually, first for the feet, one, you bring the weight to the left, but you take off the right heel, make sure that you keep your tight tension, so the idea is not to release, is to keep the intention. So you are doing pressure as you take off the right heel. Going up, one, do the same to the other leg, two, to the other leg, three, to the other leg, four, okay? So one beat for each change. Arrive on eight, one, two, three, four. This need to, cool, to, to look cool. So for that, you need to be grounded. You need to be lower. If you keep your stretch, it will strain. It will be really strange, so keep it low. The same knee that go up with the heel, the same arm push up or pull up, okay? So you arrive with your weight on the right to be able to bring up, bring up, bring up, good? And at the same time, you have a small upper body circle back, but we don't want to change too much. It's an inside movement, okay? It's like a round movement inside to the same side of the arm. So we arrive on eight and we do one, two, three, four, we drop it down, okay? So going backwards again from the two. Two and three and four, five, six, seven, eight, one, two, three, four. To give even more flow at the same time that you do the heel, the knee, the arm, keep it low, circle here, you can do a kind of shake on your thigh. Boom. Ka. So at the same time that you bring, ah, ah, tap and shake. Shake, 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 to give more flow. And try to dance with the entire body. Don't straight stretch with your neck. So the idea here is to smile and to keep it low. Okay? Good. So as we finish here on four, we're going to use our arms. The left stay forward and the right cross forward. Five, to the side, six, right hand to the left shoulder, seven, right hand to the right shoulder, eight, okay? But at the same time, you need to keep the groove. So my advice is to keep touching with your right leg. Five, six, seven, eight, keep the same bounce. From here, pick up the right shoulder and bring your right leg with your right hip. One and two, and on two we are sideways to the front position. On three, just one beat, bring it back to the front position. Three, and now use your left shoulder, touching with your left to the side, four. And you look a little bit to the right, okay? So with the counting we do five, six, seven, eight, and one, and two, three, and four. Good? So it's important, like an intention of throwing up, okay, that come here, but then you reach with the left shoulder, good? So we arrive here on four. Walk, just the final part. Walk with your left on five. Walk with your right on six. And now it's like presenting like the, uh, the 16th century dancers dancing from the court of the friends. So here, we're gonna present the right hand. Make sure that you use your wrist to do a circle here. Like the left hand is back, the right is forward presenting, okay? So you arrive on six and seven, and on eight, you project the hand with the palm four up. The left arm is here to the back, and the left leg is forward. So we walk five, six, and seven, and eight. So pointing forward, and on one, we do a dab. So bring your left leg back and hide your eyes on your arm. So in the side position, you're gonna see 
rum, rum, no, sorry, rum, rum, pum, pa. And we finish here on the one of the music. And after, it will be a little bit of improvisation for all the guys, okay? Mm -hmm. 